All right, in this video I'm going to do the same examples I did in the previous video, but I'm going to use a technique called U, oh, that's not a U, U, there we go, substitution. This is kind of a wonderful technique. And think of this technique as getting you through the messy part. So we know we have to square both sides, right? So it's going to look like this, just like before. And we need to square both sides. So in order to avoid squaring something with a radical in it, what you're going to do is you're going to say let u equal the radical x minus 5. And I pick that because of these two terms in the binomial. Obviously, the radical x minus 5 is the messy one, more complicated. One simple. Square root of x minus 5, not so simple. So now my equation looks like this. The square root of x on the left side, and over here I've got u plus 1, and it can't get any simpler looking than that. The technique is the same. Square both sides. When we square the left-hand side, we get x. When we square or foil out the right-hand side, we're going to get u squared plus u plus u plus 1. Combining like terms, you get u squared plus 2u plus 1. That got you through the foiling. Now at this point, you back substitute. So in, a, in other words, everywhere there's a u, here's a u, and here's a u, you're going to put back in the square root of x minus 5. So moving up here to the right, it's going to look like this. x equals, well now we got that radical, x minus 5, and it's squared. And then we've got plus 2, and then u, there's that back substitution, x minus 5, and then plus 1. And then it's going to work out exactly the same as in the previous video. So I'm going to actually stop it at this point, because you can watch the other video to continue. But this is an example of U substitution. And it is really a handy thing to use. It helps get you through the foiling in this case, or the bi binomial multiplication involving a radical. So wonderful, wonderful technique.